We're also uh, doing a live stream, but this is instead of just playing a while, but instead of doing stuff like regular uh, uh, vanilla Minecraft or what we usually do, which is Minecraft mini games, instead we're doing two videos in one. Well, it's not really a live stream, but I'm just going to call it live stream because <laughs> because we aren't really doing anything. We're just covering two things. The hardest item to craft by our fall ends. And, and some brand new advancements added into into today's video. Starting with number one, the lodestone. This is a difficult to craft item because of the certain materials. Requiring Requiring chiseled stone boot, eight chiseled stone bricks, and a netherite ingot, you all to craft this one lovely lodestone. The point of the lodestone is you have to compass and when you do so you'll get the new advancement country road take me home and there's also a new feature where if you have hold f3 and 4 you can switch which game mode you would like in this case we're gonna choose survival respawn angel This is another one that's difficult to craft. If you get Crying Obsidian, get Who is Cutting Onions? We'll couple all the other advancements in a second. Why right now, the only way you can get Crying Obsidian all by bobbing with piglins, finding one in a bastion, which is that little thing right here. Or finding it in a ruined portal, which is the portal that's ruined, I guess. And then, bam, you get the respawn anchor. Respawn angles can be used to set your spawn point, and when you activate it fully, you'll get the advancement not quite nine lives. And you can also you can respawn in a nether. Here's an honorable mention: the Gnaw Chapel. Now this is actually now this is an item that is can no longer be crafted. When a pan fill up item, the other being the saddle. Those those being the saddle, certain types of certain types of horse armor and chainmail armor, as well as netherite armor as well. If we were to do this in now, now you can craft. Now you can craft. No. Now I know, now you probably know that you can, now it's a note that you can craft regular golden apples, but you 
can no longer craft the notch apple in modern versions. So sad. It's all gonna burn in lava, blah, blah, blah. Moving on, the beacon. One of the hardest craftable, uh, one of the hardest uh, item, uh, one of the hardest blocks to craft. Needing three obsidian, five of, uh, five, uh, five glass blocks, and another stall to get yourself a lovely beacon. This thing will emit light and all sorts of stuff. The brown creeper firewall. You will need a firewall start with creeper shaped explosion. And using using brown dye, combining these all in crafting table will give yourself a firewall rocket. Yeah, pretty hard to craft. And apparently they I don't know how that happened. Anyways, tipped arrows, these are very hard to craft. Especially the invisibility ones. Uh, especially um, tipped arrow, uh, uh, tipped arrow of invisibility. Those are especially hard to craft. We go for total helmet. It seems like that one's kind of stuff. I said helmet. Don't get me wrong. So. Yeah, this total helmet is uh, is it's fairly easy to craft, but uh, but scoots themselves are pretty hard to get, nonetheless. Choco boxes. Needs you need two choco shells, which are hard to get themselves, and a chest to get yourself a lovely choco box. can finally stand on your least favorite mobs to, uh, uh, and, and, and be your own mob. Um, don't think Shoko's all entities. But hey, you can pick them up again. And yeah, it works. That's pretty interesting. Hope it's not, but I don't think so. The Thing Banner. You don't need a crafting recipe for this one, but the Thing Banner's craftable craftable with one people and this is the whole pelt an enchanted golden apple as i mentioned enchanted golden apples are no longer craftable meaning the only way to get one is to find so as a result and no oh thank you thank you so Good idea, set my spawn point. And that's it, my friends. Now it's time to cover the new things. They will now, uh, this is, there is now a game mode switcher. Folding F3 and 4 will bring you out to this result. And you can press F4 to switch around until you found one you're comfortable for. So, for example, if you want to be in survival mode, you can be in survival mode. Want to be in creative mode? We'll be in creative mode. Anyways, moving on. The first one, those were the days, Enter Bastion Remnant. Oh, Oh, bastions for short. Those were the days! Yay! And what do we have here? Oh, nice! 
sweaty of ancient debris. Wow. Gilded blackstone. And we have, whoa, how is it so nice? If we have nice, now we have some nice loot in here. Wall pigs. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, so which is where you loot a chest. In a bath, uh, in in a bastion remnant, and that's how you get this lovely gray loot. What's in here? Soul speed. Nice. That's a very well <laughs> fashions off with some nice. Moving on, we've done these two. Now, now we move to hidden in the depths, where you have to obtain. Ancient debris, and that's what we just did. And that's what we just did. I'm actually gonna know we're both. Um, Actually, gonna uh, well, bulk management to show this. Okay, uh, that was uh, that was a mistake. Ancient debris takes some time to mine, but once you've done it. You finally have some lovely ancient debris. This is a, this this is gonna be very very interesting. Moving on, done that. Cover me in debris. Get a full set of nether white armor. Challenge and not unlike uh, the cover me in diamonds one. Uh, uh, unlike cover me in. What? And we've got a full set of Netherite armor. Unlike cover me with diamonds. Unlike Cover Me of Diamonds, this one's a challenge because Ancient Debris is very well, or is much, uh, Ancient Debris is much well than Diamonds. Hey there, hey there. And oh, hello, Caitlin. Right, that's that. Substance blob, whatever. I've covered some of these, blah, blah, blah. This next one is very new. Oh, oh, shiny. Oh, oh, oh shiny. Alright, so let's gather a bit of gold for now and we're gonna switch and whoops why what it's it's so easy to take screenshots now he seems peaceful at first and I actually want to get to a high place so he won't get me
says we're gonna turn let's turn it on now. And he's angry. Come on. Come on now. Come on. He's still going after me. Okay. Why? There we go. Why are you not getting it? Hello? Hello? Excuse me. He's really uninterested. Oh, on easy mode. What? Oh, I've told... Oh, I hear some. Here's an area with some piglins. Now and and, and all they, Why are they not going for it? All right. Gold ingots doesn't roll. Let's try gold nugget. We're just, we're just gonna, uh, uh, we're just gonna use a command because for someone, for some reason, why well, moving on, move to the Nether Biomes one. This one, this one is very interesting. The strider one. All you need, all you need is this with some more fungus. Put that on. So to survive in mode. This boat has legs. That's it. This boat has legs. You can get it by riding striders. We you can get it by riding striders. The final one is a very This one you have to visit every single biome in the game. Not like if we not close <laughs> No, that's not what every single nether biome. Yo yo, we just found ourselves up a soul deltas. This is the combination this is like the, the volcanic ruins and we found another portal. A terrible fortress! Yo! Right, the only other bind we have left 
is the Soul Sand Valley. And we should teleport to Dale. Hot Tois Destinations! Yo! There are other changes as well. First off, with Sigma Blackstone, we get Stone Age. Also, Striders are now counted against the, uh, uh, for the 2x2 two two, uh, advancement. And Bullseye, you have to hit the Bullseye from target from 30 meters away. So we are going to try to do exactly that. Now, before uh, before you just had to hit the bullseye. Now you have to hit the very uh, very middle. Oh. Well, that's interesting. to do and as you can see we're getting fairly close see the middle that's exactly where we need to hit it But as you can see, it's super difficult. Well, I don't know if we will fairy box it. Let's try it now. We are three or two. This is three, six, four. Okay, this is, okay. I think this is 30 blocks away. So now we just need to get lucky and see if we can hit the very middle. Very Getting ridiculously close, maybe aim a little higher. Let's aim up that way. Oh, that was too high. What the heck? Let's aim there. But as you can see, it's extremely hard do so. Actually, that's, actually, look, that's good. We could try to get the very middle of that guy right there. It was do this peel all time, and oh. Let's change that. If we have the F3 op menu open, we can see where we are. That should be good enough. But since that doesn't really work, let's try, let's try something. Bit, and unfortunately.
Unfortunately, the glitch no longer exists. This was super close, super close, and a little bit higher. We are so close. Let's see where they are. Ooh, we we just need to aim a bit higher. Oh, that's way too high. That's too low. Come on, so. We're super close. Come on. Oh, getting it. We just need to hit the very middle. Any of them I've hit yet? No. getting ridiculously close. gonna land this uh, thing. We are just gonna get that. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you later. Bye.